R means what option makes it the third R easy. Question is not a difficult usually. The given options are makes it hard or easy. Actually, for example, in this same question, if they ask African countries, let us assume, or also Korea, okay, what they think? As a Indians, you know, these all three peoples are politicians. So obviously, they don't have time to do politics. They will not develop any softwares. So you can eliminate one way of eliminating. Are you getting point? I am way of thinking also I am telling you because most of the time you, uh, you uh, after exam you came out and check it with your friends after reading question you feel it either A or B is right after reading question every exam after reading question you feel it either A or B is correct C and D is wrong you feel come out exam and discuss with your friend he is also feel same thing either A or B is right you feel it, oh, both are good, both are thinking good. Okay, you see, I think it's a real experience. But after final list, both are not in the list. <laughs> you observe that one. Yeah. It's a real experience. Means what? Whatever you are thinking both is wrong, but some of you qualified, they, they have selected either D or CRD. <laughs> are you getting my point? Some of you qualified. They, they think in a different angle, they qualified, they are selected, not A and B, definitely, they are selected either C or D. Means they are also human beings, they are also studying the same subject, why they are thinking C, C and D? But why not you and me? Are you getting? We are thinking. So, same question, if you ask African country or other countries, they don't know any names, they will think, Narendra Modi, yeah, it is a catchy name, maybe he may develop. <laughs> okay, sometime Rajiv Gandhi, somewhere he heard uh, in internet, uh, means word history, he heard the word is Gandhi. Yeah, Gandhi heard somewhere, yeah, he may develop this one. Because he heard that name in history actually. Yeah. I heard this name somewhere, yeah, yes, yes, he may develop. Way of thinking, I'm telling you. I'm not telling what is the question and answer. Most of the time, Hey, this one, I think somewhere I heard this word select. Okay, so look at same question now. You heard name is Dennis Ritchie most of the time. See, you know about Dennis Ritchie, Dennis Ritchie. After looking at yeah, Dennis Ritchie, maybe because you heard so many times the same name. Are you getting my point? So, what I am trying to explain here use elimination method. You are eliminated using your pre-existing knowledge pre-existing knowledge as a indians you know all these three peoples are politicians or else you may think in another angle yeah, all these three peoples are indians definitely indians are not developed like this software so you select this one we are thinking i'm telling you actually if you go through this book most of the theories most of the mathematical development everything done indians hindu arabic means what Indian uh, means whatever uh, old India okay Hindu Arabic it is uh, history actually okay uh, but nowadays in our mind even though as a Indians we feel like that we, ourselves we feel it uh, India is not good then who will tell uh, it is good others uh, definitely they will not tell okay leave it it is a uh, second uh, debatable uh, is it okay first so way of thinking first Try to think you you are use this one elimination. Now we we'll go for this one. In which year Akbar was born? <laughs> actually, no one knows, including me. Actually, actually, no one knows when Akbar was born. But even without knowing any answer, I can I can get full marks. In objective type question. Okay, definitely. I think everyone know everyone answer this question now. Okay? Because 80 AD definitely Islam starts after eight, uh, sixth century. Uh, five point something or sixth century. Definitely it's not less than six. At least to keep in common sense. So 80, 180 is eliminated. Now come to 2017, either not born, not died. <laughs> so 
2017 is eliminated so remaining is without knowing we can answer is it right now look at same question which in which year akbar was born if they ask same question in history students also it's very difficult to answer look at 41 42 43 44 even history students even einstein it's very difficult to answer like these questions are you following what i'm trying to explain so try to use instead of finding what is right answer well, that is the first way you know while answering find uh, anyhow total 50 questions you know at least 10 questions exact this is the answer try to answer 10 questions next instead of finding right answer try and which is wrong answer because there are three options are wrong only one option is right instead of finding one find in three eliminate one that is easy way i think so huh. is it works i'll i'll prove it okay use pre-existing knowledge base means use pre-existing knowledge whatever you have studied last five year or three years computer science okay just try to eliminate one option at least at least one option i'm telling you okay use your pre-existing knowledge and try to answer okay now we'll go for next okay how elimination method works okay just try to eliminate as many options you try to eliminate one two three if possible if you eliminate three then obviously you'll get 100 percent answer is it right try to eliminate one try to eliminate two if you eliminate two definitely you'll get 50 percent of chances is right so next is if you eliminate one option you'll get 33 percent of chances is right likely to be right how it is 33 percent is help i'll tell you next slide okay 33 percent is right because four options uh in four out of four options you select only one row uh, oh, sorry, only one column, either C or D, out of 50. How many answers are right? You don't read any questions. Just take a question paper. Just answer C, 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 all, 1 to 50. How many answers will correct? <laughs> Approximately 12 to 13, out of 15. Okay, take 100 questions. Select option, one option, continue, D. How many options are right? 25. 25 approximately 25 because all chances are likely to be correct 25 percent a is 25 b is 25 c is 25 d is 25 are you agree are you agree one or two i i told you initially every option every question paper it's balance every question paper you go and check it you any competitive exams it is balanced okay 25 uh, 25 right means some question papers may be 27 option c is 28 but option a is 21 some questions some likely but probability definitely probability works okay so 25 percent 25 percent 25 percent 25 okay are you agree this one okay then if you eliminate one option okay then three options are remaining okay so if you select in three then 33 percent chances of getting it correct 33 percent i'll tell you how it is helpful for net exam okay next if you eliminate two 50 percent of chances it's it will be correct if you eliminate three definitely you will get a hundred percent okay so what i'm trying to explain any exams any computed exams if you first round how many questions you know confidently this is the right answer just select it first round. confidently this is the right answer even you may i mean sort you can challenge if they give wrong in key answer if they give option different you can challenge like that if you have confident like that you just answer all questions okay next round if you are in a confusion try to eliminate as many options try to eliminate one or two at least if you eliminate three means definitely it is right means you will get a hundred percent is it right so try to eliminate